Hello, welcome to Star Citizens. Well, I'm in fact becoming, um, taking the role of a deck crew. Yeah, I'm watching someone who just um, called for a Avenger spacecraft, and I'm going to basically watch, watch him take control, get in, and see how he takes off. Now, two methods of taking off. Let's see which one he does. Let's see, it's brilliant, isn't it? The way he can just climb into his seats. There's his thrusters working. Come on. And you're off. <laughs> there, vertical takeoff. There, he knows he must be playing for this camera. <laughs> and he positions himself. Landing gear up. Oh, there he goes. What is that? Oh, it's a vandal scythe. And he takes himself out slowly. I think he's showing off for the camera. <laughs> Oh, and somebody else has just called for a 300 series. Yes, the 300S. Let's see if can get in. Why don't you do a video of, of this? I mean, you can see yourself getting in, but I wanted to see someone actually get into their, to their ship. Because it's something unique on games. Go on, I'm not going in. If I bring up the AR mode, I can actually see who it is. This is... Oh, it must be French. Me Interperina. Let's see if I can... So, yeah. Oops. Hi, there it is. Uh, why is he crawled onto the floor? Why <laughs> he rolled over? I think you're in the wrong game, dude. <laughs> right, climb in. No. Come on, I want to see you climb in and do a takeoff. There's somebody over there with another Avenger. Oh, there's a uh, other Avenger over there just doing a pivotal roll. Right, is he getting in? Or is he just running down? Let's see. Oh wait, I'm not going to climb in. He was trying to find the sweet spot, as they call it. There. Is that him? Getting in? No, come on, climb in. Alright, let me just send a message. Hi, doing a video of people into their ships and taking off. Is your ship spinning? Yes, it is. Hi, man. That's the AR mode. There he is, then. Climb in. I'm not climbing in. Go on. There he goes. Climbs into his ship. There's a side hatch. And if we pull back a bit. You can probably see him getting into his seat. You see him getting there he is set. Let's switch that off. There he is climbing into his seat. Now when he powers on, his hat should shut, he says. 
There it is, but with a glitch at the moment, the ladder still stands down. So, come on. <clears throat> Let's see how your takeoff procedure is. And your go. See, so thrust is maneuvering there. He's taking off. Come on, there he is. Landing gear up. <laughs> he does a pivot. <laughs> Now he's showing off. I don't want to fall off the edge, so. <laughs> oh, and there he goes. <laughs> right, ah, there we have over there a Mustang. Is that a Delta? A Mustang Delta. This is not, it's one of the right, the, um, the racing classes, but can also be outfitted for combat. So this is the combat one with those two hefty laser cannons at the front. Is he? Is someone there? Someone coming in for a land. Yep, let me see them. Ah, oh, look at that. Excellent. He jumped out. Oh. Let's see if he comes out. There, you see him getting out of his, his chair. And which side is he going? on the other side. And he is running an Aurora. Let's see who this person is. EPPI. Let's say hello to him. EPPI. Epi? That's what's called. Epi or EPPI? Sorry, didn't want to jump. I was doing a video on people picking up and landing. Yeah, do you need me to climb it and take off? Yeah, please. Oh, sorry. Yeah. You can. Yep, there you go, there he goes. See him taking off, um, sorry, climbing in. And then we're going to see him getting in. Now when, he's land, when he starts up, his door should close. There, ah, there you go, he's, his door closes and his ladder goes off. As you can see, the uh, I think those are thrusters. There, look at that. Majestic takeoff. Well, watch that. <laughs> Not very good. Nice takeoff. Nice takeoff. Thanks. I see he hasn't come for his um, Mustang over there. Is he coming back? Alright, let's see if there's any other ships. Let's see if there's any ships about. Oh, let's go this way. He hasn't come for whoever asked for this one. He's not come for it yet. And send out a message to see if anybody's if it's anybody's. Uh, and there we go. Oh, a little bit of a, a bump. Oh, 
Oh, didn't know what happened to that. Now we got recycled. Oh, now it's jumped over to there. Oh, another one's um, been called up. Right, the Mustang series. I used to have a Mustang Amiga, that was a racing one. So I upgraded it to a, an Avenger. You should be able to get in through this end, but as you can see when the pilot does come. Is the pilot coming? Is the pilot coming? <coughs> Excuse me. If the pilot does come. We'll have a look around the ship while we're waiting for the pilot. Well, yeah, um, it used to be a side entrance next to the cockpit, but now because of this one, it has to, actually has. Does it have a sleeping quarters inside? And it has um, storage for a cargo pod. As you can see it's right there. Oh, someone's called up for a. A Mustang, but and that's flying. Oh well, we'll just have a look around this great. Oh, there he is. What's in Gold School? Let's say hi, Gold School. Just doing a bit of people taking off. There you go, so if you can get into your ship. There, there it is. So he gets in through that way. And you'll see him. See his chair turns. He slides in and it turns around. And now you should see his thrusters start moving. Let's get rid of this. Buster starts moving. Is he a vertical man or? That's a bait. Oh, there you go. See, he's going to shoot straight forward. Oh, that's a different, different way of taking off. Go on now. <laughs> Is there another ship on the hangar? Another. Oh, he's going up. And off. Off he goes, I was going to say. But no, he seems to be having a little maneuver around. Some combat threat, combat or whatever. Oh, there is a constellation there. Is those buzzings to do with something? Uh, am I gonna hurt myself when I drop? Oh, no. There we go. Now, this one's a beast of a thing. This is the. Is the Andromeda? Yeah. Uh, that'll be something with its turret. Oh, here we go. You get someone going to climb. There you go. See the hatch comes down. Who's this guy? What's his name? Ah, I can't see. Couldn't see it. And then he goes in, and hopefully, let's get rid of that. We can see him. Yeah, see the chair swivel? I'm gonna get too far. And as it goes back round, he's in the pilot's chair. Alright, you're cleared for takeoff.
See the thrusters on the side? Oh, look at that. That is a beautiful ship. It's much more better when you can see it actually in action. I know they're, they're, they're fantastic on the hangar where you can have a look around, but to see actually someone get in. How did you just turn up? See someone actually get in. Get into their seat. Open the hatch, get into their seat. Climb aboard. Start the engines and then... Oh, what's he doing? He's flying upside down. You didn't think a ship that big could be that manoeuvrable, didn't you? Couldn't you? Oh. And I think that he just went into quantum drive. And here we have another guy. Who's this? This is Gold School. I got school. I go got any more ships I have to run off then <coughs> it's because I saw see the other one. Okay, we'll find some other ship. Thanks for the chat, or well, the non-existent chat. There should be a stairs to go up to the second deck. Let's we'll take the shortcut. <coughs> Excuse me. Shortcut meaning we'll jump off the edge. Whee! There we go. There he is, and oh, someone, another Mustang Amiga, not Amiga, uh, Mustang. I'm not sure which. Is. I think it's the Delta. And there he goes into. That's a different variant of the um, the Aurora. This is the Aurora. Let's see him climbing. Now I'm not going to climb in for with you. as he powers up his door and ladder should door should close ladder should extract there's his um, reactors okay take it up all you want for just skim him right out oh no he's a vertical takeoff right? goes oh a majestic flight let's be doing it for the camera on your head. See that's the difference with this game. That is the, the big difference. I know you've got other games like Elite etc etc but um, 
I'm trying to. I've been thinking back in my brains all morning about which game. Oh, the 300 series. Looks like a 300 A. Anyway, yeah, I'll be trying to wrap my brains of which game actually lets you get in and out of a, of a ship and actually fly about. We're not just talking, you know, a couple of meters or something like that, but actually use a thing called a quantum jump, go to a different sector in the in the space where you're in, which technically it's flying normal speed isn't it even at your top of speed will take hours probably days and then come back land the ship and actually get out look at that that's just awesome where you can watch a pilot a guy in his ship uh, see, here we go for a landing. Look at this. Same so landing ship. Beautiful. It's a Orangin 300i series. How does he get out? Is he still in it? Yep, he's just got out. Now we have to see which which side he gets out. Oh, he's getting out this side. <laughs> it's not waiting for the ladder. I'm just going to jump out. <laughs> you just got to abandon this. See, this one's more of a race. It hasn't got the the weapons mount on the bottom. In fact, it hasn't got any. But oh, it has got some weapons. There it is. Quite a, quite a bunch of there's another 300 <clears throat> there's another 300 right there are you getting back in have you gotten back in yep yeah, can see him let's see him see him. ah they that's what's been missing out of most of them the shield coming up. See his thrusters. <clears throat> Maneuvers the ship up. Oh. You see he was doing he was doing great. Now look <laughs> you came in you landed perfectly. You took off great. And then you went into your drunken mode. Where you're hitting everything. Okay. Oh, he's went up to say hello to another 300. Okay, do we have time for one more? If it comes, let's see something different. I'm just wondering if um. Whoa! Ah, there you go. Something different. Ask for something different. He comes up, and what do we have here? The cutlass. <clears throat> Is this the cutlass red? I can't remember. I know there's, there's a, a variance of cl um, cutlasses um, from the hospital to the cargo to the troop carrier. I think the, the hospital one is the red. Okay, it's armed to the teeth, isn't it? It's got three weapon mounts on the bottom here and a turret on the top. And here we go with someone getting in, hatch comes down, he walks in, comes back up, now he should be getting into the cockpit, oh he's come back out, <laughs> there was a hatch on the bottom, <laughs> I think he pushed the wrong button, is he? <coughs> People who know the, the the cutlass, there's two two buttons. One's for the the turret, and another one for the. <laughs> he's gone back in. Push the wrong button. Get to know your ship. Right, 
let's see how this one takes off. You'll see him getting into his the cockpit there. Is he getting in this time? Oh, he's into the toe. <laughs> Excuse me. This one is is very very glitchy. This ship is. If you don't get the buttons right, he can end up. Is he going to drop out again? See, there there is an actual button to open the door to get into the cockpit. There he is. He's managed to get in. <laughs> and somebody else looks like they're getting in. You better hurry up. He's about to take off. Right, let's see the posters on this. There we are. There's a directional thrust there. Oh, look at that for a majestic takeoff. He's left his hatch open on the bottom. Oh, look at the missiles as well. Okay, oh, and he shoots off into the distance. Did his landing gear go up? I didn't notice if his landing gear went up. Like, you see now if that was a planet that would be awesome if you could just take her from here and just fly right down to the planet hopefully fingers crossed that'll be the next um, update <coughs> update what would be 2.2 or even update 3 we'll have us flying down to the planet oh another aurora has come in okay I'm going to leave it there I'm going to add some other videos onto this. Um, a friend of mine, Mr. Snyder, you should watch the video with him in. He's in a, a, a 300S series, I think. And he did a, a nice fly around. Um, came back for a landing and managed to get into his ship and watch him come in on the other side and do a quantum jump but it glitched out I because I wasn't strapped in or something like that I ended up floating in the middle of space orbiting the crusader planet there but he was still still good to watch he was uh, oh he's a, a 300 actually but like I said we're gonna I'll attach the um, the videos for that onto this so um, keep watching it's beyond this but uh, thanks for watching, this is Dred's Guess, remember the name, but remember, keep carry on watching, because the other videos of other ships that I've been filming will be on straight after this. Enjoy.
Contact. Scanning. <laughs> 